What's up guys, it's Daddy Oz Gamer Chick here and today we've got some good news and some bad news coming from uh, Ubisoft. So I think we'll start off with the bad news just so we can get that over and done with. So today um, Ubisoft announced that Watch Dogs is being pushed back to the second quarter of 2014. So that would be autumn here in Australia or spring in the US. So this is kind of shitty news. Yes, it sucks. I was so looking forward to the Watch Dogs but I guess it's good in a way that, you know, they feel like they can do so much better and they want to do so much better that they're going to push it back a few more months. So if they were going to release it in November like it was originally announced, it wouldn't be as good as it's going to be um, next year. So I guess it's good and bad news, but ultimately, I, I mean, you know, everyone that wanted, you know, is looking forward to Watch Dogs was lo really looking forward to that they're going to play it next month. But uh, unfortunately, that's not going to happen. So it's a few more months away. Um, but yeah, like I said, we we can expect a better game from it. So now on to the good news. Uh, with Watch Dogs being pushed back a couple of days ago, uh, Ubisoft announced that Assassin's Creed 4 is being pushed forward. So uh, in Australia here, it's being pushed forward to, actually I think it's worldwide, uh, October 29th. So this is two days than it was originally supposed to be, which was October 31st. It's not a huge difference, but you know, it's two days earlier. Like, why are you, <laughs> it's so much more exciting. Um, it's also, uh, October 31st was when uh, Battlefield 4 was going to be uh, released as well. So this way, you know, you have a few days to play Assassin's Creed 4 uh, as much as you want. And then if you guys are getting Battlefield 4, then you can decide which one you want to play then. But uh, yeah, uh, it was. I it didn't even occur to me that Assassin's Creed 4 and Battlefield 4 were, were released on the same day um, until like last week or something. But now they're not. Uh, Assassin's Creed 4 has been pushed forward a couple days. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's not on my usual day, but it was, you know, pretty, you know, crazy news. Uh, with Watch Dogs being pushed back a few months, uh, which really sucks, but, you know, what can you do? I'm just excited to play it, and, you know, I will definitely be getting it on the next-gen console then, since, you know, it's <laughs> definitely going to be out in the next gen. Um, there is not too much news going about, you know, pre-orders with Watch Dogs. Uh, I don't think anything's come out from Ubisoft, but a few retailers and Amazon are saying that um, if you guys have pre-ordered like a bundle with Watch Dogs, you can keep the bundle and you'll get the console when it comes out and they will send you the game when it comes out. And I believe some retailers are saying you can change your bundle if you would like. But um, I don't think they're all set in stone. So if you guys, you know, are curious, you can, you know, ring up your retailer and see what the deal is with all that. They may have a better understanding than what I do. Otherwise, we'll have to wait until Ubisoft makes an announcement or something. So that's it from me today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys next time. All right, bye.